What's up guys, welcome back to Let's Play and Goku Basara. So we defeated the Maeda and it looks like Nobunaga is gonna... Dang it! Okay good, he left Satsuma for us, great. Hold on. What's going on here? Oh great, we're under attack! This can happen, it actually happens very rarely in this game. Do You get a counterattack, attack um, but it's usually when Nobunaga controls... Uh, Majority of the land is when this happens. It only happens once per campaign, really. Um, and you have this defend mission. It usually, again, it usually have not strictly speaking Nobunaga, but when another one other army controls majority of the land, it seems to be when it happens the most frequently. But it's pretty random, and it only happens late in the game. So basically, what we have to do here is uh, just defend our borders until the time runs out, and there is a time limit here. Um, there are, as you can see from the very small map we have here, uh, quite a few commander units. We have, uh, we're up against, obviously, the Oda clan, if I didn't say so twice before, and all of his ridiculously powerful halberd knights that we fought uh, back in Masamune's campaign. And um, you can see that there are uh, c command units at the very back of the lines there, um, but the ones with the flashing, um, uh, what do you call it, the flashing radius around them on the mini-map, are obviously the most threatening because those are the ones that are actually moving towards your gate. And you can pretty much clear, I mean Yukimura is so powerful at this point with his ridiculously broken ultimate weapon. We can pretty much clear out all these guys in a few seconds and then um, move back over to the other gate. So they won't be able to do much damage to it. Although we are playing on ultimate difficulty so if we stray too far they can quickly uh, surround it. And we might be in trouble. But despite how uh, one gate may look severely damaged, like this one's got flaming arrows in it and it's just all dented up and everything, one of them might start to look really messed up really fast. Um, but it's honestly not that bad. It's, um, oh great. I was doing my uh, secondary attack there, the new one that I unlocked. And um, I, I, got to, I got a chance to show that off in the previous video, right? Yeah, I did. But... Um, he interrupted my, uh, he cancelled me out there with his, uh, um, heavy attack. Anyway, yeah, like I said, despite how damaged the gates looked, you really only have to be concentrated on the actual health bar up there and make sure that stays intact while uh, the timer counts down. And again, I don't think, uh, the amount of enemies that you kill really has any factor in, um, how quickly this ends. But Yukimura is a very good character for this because, well, Honestly, he's just he's just a good all-around character. But he's kind of broken in this first game if you have him maxed out, like I do. And uh, despite how much I praised Masamune, and I think I kind of prefer Masamune for very techy reasons, I still think that Yukimura is kind of overpowered. Um, like I said, it's, it all depends on the matchup that you're going against too. Like certain characters do better against certain other characters. Um, but as far as these defend missions go, you really need a character that um, swings wide and is fast, and that's what Yukimura does well. Other characters might be good at this. Um, Shimatsu might be good at this. Um, I don't think the ninjas would be very good at this. Um, obviously, um, Nobunaga and um, Takeda Shingen would be very good at this as well. We'll be getting to Nobunaga's campaign soon enough, and oh, I have some, uh, I have some choice words for him when we get to him. Trust me. Now, the uh, the only thing I'm really worried about with this, this is going to be a short video, by the way. The only thing I'm worried about with this is the fact we may not get a second chance to take over Satsuma now because Nobunaga might get another turn, which would suck because I really want to show off uh, Satsuma. That's the one map we've not gotten to show off yet. The one and only map we've not gotten to show off yet. We've shown off all the other ones except for Kenshin's main map. I think we've not shown that one off yet, but we will soon enough. And hopefully we'll get to um, uh, Satsuma by the end of uh, this Let's Play at least. Because I've done that map so many times during test playing. And I had such, you know, it's, it's completely random. So I always got that map during test playing no matter who I was playing guys. I never got Zavis. And it seems like chess playing, or actually recording this, I've gotten Zabi more times than I've gotten um, Shimatsu. So, as you can see right here, this gate looks really, really banged up, but we still have like half the health bar for the, uh, the gate up there. So, nothing to worry about for the most part. Alright, so we uh, won the race against time, and our borders are safe, apparently. 
Would have been nice if we said the cavalry there like we do all the time, but Yukimura is just too good for that.